Welcome to Motivated Results. So today I'm going to do a very quick video on branched chain amino acids. Really this is just a preface for a couple videos that I'm going to be producing or creating in the next couple weeks. And I wanted to give you um, my thoughts on it prior to reviewing the products. If you're unaware of what branched chain amino acids are, they're essentially an amino acid uh, that is usually contained within food, but you can also buy free form versions of them at a supplement store, or vitamin shop, or online, or wherever you buy your supplements from. What is the reason why most people take them? Well, people believe that the more of these amino acids that you have in your body, the more likely you are to build more muscle. Now, the, the idea for most people is that you do get a large portion, if not more than enough, through foods. So why add them? Well, I don't know. Um, I think it just depends on the different schools of thought and the different people that you end up talking to that you can find studies proving their their benefits in one hand and then on the other hand you can find studies that disprove it altogether. So I thought I would make my own test and see if I thought they were beneficial. Um, in the end, what did I think about them? Well, overall they were by far a great uh, mental boost. They actually, you know, helped me push harder and not worrying about being catabolic or losing muscle mass or whatnot. And they were great in a sense for that. They also made it very easy to consume water. These things are usually, the ones I use were flavored and um, they made water taste amazing. But are they necessary? Do I suggest them? No. The only time I would suggest them is unless you're trying you want to try something new or you just have money you just want to try try wasting on supplements. Uh, for the most part they're they taste great they're a decent product I, I'll be reviewing a couple that I'll talk about later on but for me they were really a mental boost more than anything else and they didn't really supply me with any visual differences from what I can tell. Um, <clears throat> last cut wasn't as successful as this one so there are some differences there but overall, I mean, I, I feel like I retained as much muscle mass as I was going to retain during my cut as I would have if, if I didn't have the supplement. So overall, that's my thought on branched chain amino acids. I will be reviewing these products later on, so keep an eye out for those. But any questions, comments, let me know. Thanks again for watching.